And we're back, guys. Tennis in a minute. I'm your host, Get Energy. I give you the rundown on tennis coverage every day. Stay tuned for the fastest minute in tennis. But first, we pick up here the Miami Open WTA 1000 round one, day number two. And we have big game, Sophia Kennan. Listen, I don't care if you call her Sophia or Sonia. Just don't leave out the big game. But she hasn't played taking on Ice Veins, Katie Volley Nets. Now listen, Katie is ranked 121st. She's got to get back inside the top 100. But listen, she's going to need to get a big win here against Sophia Kennan, who's ranked 58th. But listen, Sophia's only 1-7 in seven on the short season thus far. Now that's right, guys, 1-7. in seven, While Katie Volley Nets is 16-6, and six, We've seen her come through qualifiers, and I say this all the time. If you're looking for an upset, you want to take a look at a player that's come through qualifiers. They're used to the courts. They're warmed up. They're playing well because they're winning. They're able to put together a string of matches that they've won, and they've gotten through tough tests of players that want game checks. They want a chance to make the main draw. So they're fighting with everything they have. They're showing up in these cities with expenses, with travel, room and board, transportation. They are playing to win. And when you have a qualifier that comes through and they're taking on someone that hasn't played or they're in bad form, watch out for the upset alert. Now, Sophia Kennan, guys, only one and seven on the year, but she's lost to some tough opponents. I mean, Victoria Tomova. Igas Fiontech, she lost to Mary Boo, Heather Watson, Daria Seville, Rodia Nova, Serana Kersea. She's lost to tough opponents. Those are those are 50-50 matches, right? With the exception of Igas Fiontech. But we did see Iga. We did see Iga and Kennan. They they went head to head. But these two played in San Diego, right? Last season, not too long ago, where Sophia Kennan won that match. And I said last season. Sophia Kennan going into October. She shouldn't be playing late September, October. She needs to shut it down so she can rest, recover, and be healthy for the new season because she doesn't have any points to defend. She's not going to make a big leap in the rankings, right? Where was she? I forget. I think she was inside the top 40 around there. She's not going to pick up any points playing 125 tournaments. Shut it down. Make sure you're ready for the Australian leg of the tour where you can pick up a great deal of points and then really make a leap in the rankings. But no, she kept playing and she started this season banged up. Listen, good energy knows best. So now taking on Katie Volley Nuts, what do we have here? Look, Katie's playing solid. Look, she's won seven of her last 10. Her three losses, all tough comp competitors. I mean, for the most part, look, Storm Hunter, who's an amazing doubles player. She's a solid player. She's getting back to where she needs to be in the singles ranking. Danielle Collins, who's just got a lot of power. And Waz, a slam champion. And this first set, guys, watching Sophia Kennan just scramble to get these balls back. If you take a look there, it's a 50 50 matchup. That's not good because if Sophia Kennan was in form, she wins this match, I think, pretty easily. But she's not in form. She looks great, by the way, but she's not in form. And watching Katie just tee off on her, she, she's just attacking the back foot. She can't close out well. And Katie is just, just being in form, youthful, athletic. She's getting balls back to where Sophia Kennan can't keep up with the pace. And she's netting a lot of these shots. Katie takes the first set, two aces, one double fall. She got 80% of her first serves in play. She won nearly 80% of them. Sophia did attack the second serve of Katie, winning 80% of those. But Sophia Kennan lost 56% of her first serves. She tried to make it up on the second serve, but Katie, look, she jumped out ahead. Four breakpoint opportunities. She converted on two, and she did not give Kennan a single opportunity to break her. Katie takes the first set. That was my pick. Tennis in a minute. We'll be back.